Hey guys, Ray here from Two Gaming Girls, and in today's video, we're gonna start a new set. We're gonna start a fountain set. Uh, we're gonna do all kinds of fountains: uh, modern fountains, medieval fountains, um, kind of fancy greenery. Um, they're gonna be simplistic to complex. So there's gonna be a lot of them. Um, today we're gonna start with some modern fountains. You can see the one behind me right now. This is the one that um, in our last video when I kind of said, here's some of my unfinished builds, tell me what you think, tell me what you wanna work on. Um, someone said that you should work on what you feel like working on, right? And I kinda, of, even though this probably wasn't the coolest one of my, out of my unfinished designs, it was kind of the one I wanted to work on next. So I kind of finished this up. I made some changes, especially to the top, to kind of give it a more simplistic, really simple, modern look. Although, right now you can kind of see the lights up there. I mean, you can't see it from back here, or you couldn't before. Anyway, I might come back and change that. I don't want to see the light. Yeah, okay, so I might come back and work on that, but not today. Today, we're going to finish up this design. Uh, this is one I saw somewhere online. Um, it, it, you know, it, it kind of inspired me, so I've kind of mocked up my own version of it, and it's a fountain where we have one kind of a ring, half a ring going around that way, and the water trickling down, and then one kind of doing this little curve right here and coming down. So let's get started on working on this so i said i wasn't going to work on this and then the first thing i did after i stopped recording my intro was come over here and work on this so all i did i'm not sure it's going to be the final design but all i did was add some half slabs in the middle here so that the lights were hidden but the, the light could still shine through. We might need to do something still on this front side, um, but for now, at least it, it's looking a little bit better. Yeah, okay. So over here, um, sorry it's not daytime, so it might be a little bit hard to see, I apologize. But um, I, I wanted, I didn't want this to be grass. So at first I was like, well, I'll leave it you know, grass and people can place it on any kind of pattern, you know, ground that they want. I wish, of course, they still can. But I think I want to design this a little bit more and maybe even come out here with a little bit of the bedrock that I put in the middle. I chose not to do limestone because I thought that would be a little too much. Um, so the, the next thing I want to work on pretty much is um, we have to do the flooring here fill it with water and then add lights to it. Um, and if we have enough time, I think there's another similar design that um, I saw online I wanna try. It's a smaller double ring kind of set. But right now, what I think I wanna do, instead of just having limestone at the bottom over here, I wanted to see if we could add any kind of color. So I chose this since it's already blue. Um, I didn't want it, I wanted color but not Nothing that really took away from the fact that this is water. So let's see how this will look. We're going to fill in, let's do this whole section right here. And we'll put water down and see what it looks like. Okay, we got that. And then this looks like a bathroom. <laughs> this may not be the best water source. Looks like a bathroom floor. Let's put a little over here. And probably need to do right there, there. We're gonna do along the edges so that it's the right height. Okay. Hmm. You know what? Let's let's do another. Let's do the other side in um, limestone and just figure out which one looks better. And this is a hole. You know, I was against this limestone, but after seeing that, I'm thinking maybe we need to stick with the limestone. I think the transition from here down into that um, blue towel looked a little weird for me. Uh, 
All right, so we're gonna clean all this up, lay down some water, and see what this looks like. Put a couple drops down, let that spread around. Fill in over here. And try not to fall. All right, let's look. You know what it is? It's this block right here. That's that did not get placed where I wanted it. That oh, I placed water. It's <laughs> going. Why is there no block? But I heard the sound, and then there's more water. Okay, might need to go down to fill that in. Let's do that without breaking our necks. Okay, and hmm, I think we can get this in time. No, no, we cannot. Let's try this. There we go. Okay, so let's fly back up and see what that looks like. And we need a bedrock right there. Okay, that doesn't look bad. Although now it makes me think maybe we should go back to the other side and see if when I remove that, does it look better? Hmm. I think there is actual ground on there. Let's let's do this. Let's divert the water to this way. I'm gonna take out this. We're eventually gonna get there. <laughs> adding a million pieces all right so down there we need to be the blue piece and then take put that back oops limestone there we go take all the bedrock out god dang it all right there and there probably was a faster way to do that okay so now that we oh bedrock now that we put that piece in that might have been honestly the piece that was missing hmm yeah now I'm starting to like the blue again let me let me look one more time ah oh, that's just too plain all right we're gonna go with this so I'm gonna go fill all of this in with this um what's the exact name the blue adobe floor that's not really the blue adobe floor is it i thought that was a like all solid no that's the what color what is that other blue that is blue concrete wonder if that would look better is it cheaper to make not really not really but we might okay i'm gonna go craft a little bit of this and try that and I'll be right back. Okay, so here is the blue concrete, which is nice. It, it, it does what I said earlier. It adds color, but it's still blue, doesn't detract from it. Um, but I, I think I kind of like this still. I think even though it's modern and supposed to be in some ways very simplistic, I like this because in essence, it's a bunch of little blocks, just like these are you know just smaller version and I could see there being you know if someone had this modern fountain at their house or you know mini mansion castle uh, since it's so big I think they would have a little sparkly stuff in there you know they're gonna they're gonna go for a little bling in their fountain so I will now go cut out all this and place down the uh, blue Adobe and cut back in once we have that done to figure out our lighting situation Okay, so I am done laying out all of the adobe, the blue adobe, and I think it looks good. I like it. Um, now we have to figure out the lighting situation. These rings need to glow a little, and I'm not certain how I want to do that. It would be great if I could get lights inside of this, but I there's no way to hide the light. 
you know it just these are what's being used to hold the water so even if I change this to a light I'd have to bring them down a lot lower to, to cover up the light so I went ahead and made a few lights and I made some bedrock slabs so I think we're gonna have to do the old slab method in the ground so I'm thinking we want at least one kind of right in the middle I'm gonna you know I'm just gonna take out holes and see what we got so I did two over from here I'm gonna make this symmetrical so that will be another light um, and we need a light here I'm thinking right right there maybe or do we want it maybe here yeah all right and then we're gonna put that bedrock piece back um, come over here that will be the other light so that is four lights now we probably should have some lights in between so maybe maybe right up in here or do we go back one so it's kind of a it's not quite a circle but it's curving yeah we'll go what is that up one and over four so something like that is that right yes all right i'm gonna go ahead and finish this up and put the lights in and we'll see what it looks like okay so the middle is looking better but i still think the rings at the top are too light so i made four more lights and we're gonna get up here and see if we can maybe just at the top it'll work uh we're gonna need to put new water in because i had it in the center right there and right there let's see what that looks like from down below if that's going to be enough uh it's creating a weird thing but i think it's still needed let's let's go try these ends and see Ooh, overshot that let's see what we can do on the top ends up here this is going to be a little bit more trouble because the water flows out i guess we could do the same thing Ooh, maybe should we put it hmm we put it here i can start this water there but it's gonna be i think it's gonna look a little weird like i would need to start water here which it's not gonna stay or maybe it will i don't know though like does that look funny? I have a feeling that looks funny. Let's compare the two ends. Let's get over here. Yeah, this is what I was afraid of. So, let me pull her up. I believe, oops. Well, it's providing light you're on this side yeah you can see that light plain as a day all right um we could put it on the one below it and see what that looks like I'm not flying well today all right so if we remove this ooh, did not mean to remove that put that in take this out and probably put this down one and then put the water back up here yeah that's what I was afraid of hmm we could put do I have any could try some slabs we'd have to build that up everywhere though All right, let's see what that looks like. I have a feeling that looks a hot mess. Mm, it's okay. I think if we did that, we'd have to go cap all of this. Maybe even caps underneath to add a little bit more so it looks right. Actually, let's go over here and look. See what it looks like straight across. I mean, 
hitting. The light's hitting. That's better. All right, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go try to make something of that on this end and see what it looks like. Um, if all else fails, if it doesn't look right, then I think I'll just leave it like that and and move forward with my life. <laughs> move forward with our time. All right, I'll be right back. Okay, I think we're done. Um, it turned out pretty well. We got the water in and it's nice and solid here. We got the two drop downs and we have this flowing down and uh, the center's all bedrock. We have some lights hidden in there. And what I did for the lights, um, we put the two lights up on the second level so it's not seen from afar, but it lights everything up at the corners. Water still flows down. Um, and this was looking really nice. This kind of cup, uh, circle, ring, whatever, was looking nice. But this was still looking dark to me, especially down in this middle area. So in here, I extended this. This used to be a, um, uh, I think it was an open block. So I, I made another solid block and I basically built this pillar out. So we have half slabs this way, kind of tapering it. And then um, at the bottom on the floor, there's another light. The water flows down over that, so I had to cover this up right here. Uh, this so it wouldn't be seen, this middle one, so the water would stay. And then that one up there just connects it and makes it look like one pillar. I tried steps, um, two upside down steps in there, and I just didn't like the way it, the steps with their little um, kind of edging stuck out more than using the slabs slabs while you can see the edging it flows a little bit better with the full limestone blocks so this is our our second modern fountain um, I think we're gonna save my other design for the next video so stay tuned for that and many 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 more fountains I hope you enjoyed today's video and if you did please like and subscribe take care